They're not out yet. But he's excited. You can't hear him barking now, but he wasn't barking. But Odie was. Ready? Let's go. Hi, Odie. Thank you, Durant. Ready, Lexi? What'd you get stuck? I'm sorry. I got it. There we go. Good girl. Thank you. So with all this natural excitement, we're gonna do normal dog walking. Bells. I just have to watch out for the dogs with her. So it'll be normal. Way over there, Odie. I'm grabbing my poop bags. Try to clean out this one. I'll try and find that one. But here's Durant, natural state. Excitement. We're gonna go run, go potty. Lexi, you're so excited. Lexi will get more treats. Odie will get treats. The excitement. Leg kicking. Ha! Huh. What happened? Durant. Thank you. Ah, go get it! Go get the birds. Ha, Odie! Yay! Good job! You're so fast. You're so fast! Alexi, she can go potty. That's what I knew I had to clean up. See, she's going potty again. All this natural excitement, cute butt. Oh my goodness, look who it is. Hi baby. I will give her treats. Durant's not looking. Thank you. Did you get the birds? Right on the 12. Oh, of course, now that we're out, there's no more bikes. Odie. Thank you, Odie. I can see you. It's normally when you should be rewarding when your dog's doing good for absolutely nothing. Walking nicely, eye contact, good heel, right? Yeah, screw it, not today. Oh, bikes. <coughs> Hi, Lexi. Odie. The brat. Instigation. Hi, Odie. I'm not even gonna reward for it. Why? I should. But if I'm walking like a normal human being, the average dog owner, it shouldn't matter, right? Why should I reward? Dogs should just listen to me no matter what. Odie just checked in and took off again. Hi, Odie. All right, guys, turn around. Lexi. Bye, Odie. Yeah, the fastest by far. I can't keep, there's no way I keep up with that one. Look at those legs. Good job. Good job, Durant. Got my finger. We're just being normal dog walking family today. Attack. That is a five minute video. We don't have any more bicyclists coming in except for another minute. So, 
I'm gonna pause it, save some battery. Ready? Walk. No treats. Lexi, thank you, baby. All verbals. Oh, was that horrible? Bye, Odie. Odie, thank you. Durant, thank you. I almost went for the scooter. Should have rewarded, but I'm not. You should just listen. All right, so we're gonna call that good before my battery stops. That's six minutes. I don't know what a dozen cyclists go by. That's what we also call trigger stacking, if you know better. Flooding and trigger stacking. Flooding would actually be me putting him in the situation without even having to worry about it, or with me worrying about it and focusing on him trying to get through the, through the bikes. But what I'm actually doing is trigger stacking, knowing that these are triggers for him. Oh, Lexi. Knowing these are actually triggers for him and not rewarding for it. So he can handle a few, but he might go after one. So we're done. We're going to reward and go play. That's what you should do. After your dog does really good, take him out of the situation. Go play with him. Thank you, Durant. Oh, good job. That was great. Didn't even pay attention to seeing me leaving. So we're going to end it there. You can see I don't, I don't have bikes coming for a while, so what's the point? This is Scott with Seconds No One, Canine Life Coaching. Have a wonderful day and enjoy it.